Over a period of seven years, we've been observing terrific growth of these two London plane trees growing in structural soil, CU structural soil in Ithaca. For as long as we've been studying structural soil, we've been very interested in how roots grow through this new medium. We have an opportunity here to actually excavate the entire root system so we can transplant this tree safely. We wanted to do this because the trees were planted under wires. This installation has about a 30 inch depth of structural soil overlaid with a geotextile and then a sand setting bed where pervious pavers are laid on top. We used an air excavation tool to safely unearth the root system. Here you can see the roots in a quite a strong growth pattern angularly moving around and through the structural soil. The roots start at the surface but very quickly move down in the profile going down to at least 24 inches into the tree pit area. We're seeing both massive roots that tend to go down, we might call those sinker roots, as well as large buttress roots near the surface. After we unearthed most of the root system, we took it out of the ground and we actually transplanted it into a park. The tree here was about a six inch caliper tree. It had been planted about one and a half inches seven years earlier. It had grown very, very well. Some of those roots were so deep, we actually had to break them to get the tree out of the ground. The root mass that we took out of the ground was about 13 feet long and about 8 feet wide, so quite an extensive root system. We saw some massive roots, some really strongly growing roots in the profile, as well as quite a bit of fine root growth. We saw some very interesting features of how the roots move through the stone. Interestingly, we saw some gravel that was actually embedded in the roots, which had actually grown around encapsulating the stone. Here again you can see some of the gravel wedged in between the roots, the roots growing right around those. And here's a really good example of a stone being encapsulated, actually the root growing around the stone and it was wedged in there quite tightly. As roots grow through structural soil, they often get flattened and then proceed to grow normally again. This doesn't have any negative effect on root function. So we saw deformation, we saw encapsulation, we saw a lot of deep root growth as well as roots that were up at the top six inches below the surface. We have lots of evidence now that roots can grow very, very well in structural soil, and the hope is that as roots grow deeper, there'd be less potential for sidewalk heaving in the future.